Next question, in no particular order. If God was so angry with fallen angels and he is the giver of life, why would he allow children to be born to fallen angels and humans? Well, that's a great question and it comes down to God's will. Now, part of what you're asking is what was going on in God's mind when he allowed this to happen? And the truth is that's not recorded for us anywhere in the Bible. And if it was recorded. There's no way that your human mind or my human mind could possibly understand God's infinite mind. But an answer to your question, not the only answer, but an answer to your question is God's will. Now you have God's explicit will, meaning he is going to make this thing come to pass. No one and nothing on the, in the universe can stop his explicit will from happening. The other type of God's will is his permissive will where he allows things to happen. And you even use the word allows in this question. He allows children to be born. Why did God allow that to happen? It must be part of his will, his permissive will. What was going through God's mind when he allowed it to happen? I have no idea and therefore I couldn't possibly answer this question for you. That's the best that I can do. I hope this helps.